and welcome to SS Academy. Today, let's see a story about the caucus race. Once Alice was sitting with her sister. Alice felt very bored. Her sister was reading the book. At that time, a rabbit with pink eyes passed away. Then, Alice started to follow the rabbit. Then, rabbit went into a hole. Alice also started to jump into the hole. She thought it will never end. She went down, down, down. And then finally it came to an end. She ended with the hallway. She saw a teeth. On it there was a golden teeth. But the doors were so small to her to enter. And there was a bottle juice from them. And it was even labeled as drinking. As it was not written as poisonous. So she drank the juice. Um, it tastes like custard pineapple and bread toast all at once. And then suddenly she shrank to a size. And it was a right size to enter the door. But she slipped her mind to take the golden key. When she went to the table, she saw a cake under the table. It was written less eat me. And then she took a bite of it. And she grew very tall that her head touched the roof. And she started to cry. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then, at that time, few animals came strangely. swam swam and went to the river bank and then everyone came to the river bank Alice says I, I wish I hadn't cried so much I nearly cried so much and now we all are wet everyone said uh to do says now we all should get dry. What can we do now? And then Laurie says, I'm older. I will say how we can all get dry. Alice says, How will you know that you're older? What's your age? How old are you? And then Laurie says, you know, it's very rude to ask someone age. Why should I tell my age to you? The mouse says, I'll sit down first. And it started to say a story. William the Conqueror was the first Norman king of England. Alice says, How will William the Conqueror make me die? He died centuries ago. And what a dry, boring story is this? Matt says, Exactly! A dry story will dry us out. And then Dudu says, A caucus? Let's do a caucus race. It's better to do it. That will dry us out. Alice says, what's a caucus race? And then Duru explains, the caucus means a group of people. Haven't you heard a caucus of politicians? As here, our friends March, here, Hatton, Cheshire Cat are not there. So we will do today the ca caucus race. This is our track. Here the caucus race is going to happen now. 
Now, let us see them everyone to come into the caucus race. Come on Alice, come into the caucus race and everyone one by one. Everyone starts forming a line. At that time, Laurie says, I can't wait to get started. When will it get started? And Dudu says, We can start from anywhere. Kenneth says, Oh, that's not a bad idea. You all fly. I will. You all just run. I will fly. Liza, which way do we run? I have no idea which way should we run. Or which direction? When does the day start? Dudu says them all. Stand anyway. Face any direction. Run any time. Just you have to run. Lizard asks, When do we stop? I'm running out of breath. Everyone starts running. And it finally, Duru says, Stop. Stop. And then immediately, Mouse asks, is the race over? Who is the winner? I think I must be one. At that time, Dudu says, No, no, no. We all won. At that time, Mouse asks, How will everyone win? At a one race, there will be only one winner. Dudu says, Is everybody dry? We had come for this race only to dry. Everyone replies, yes, we all are dry. At that time, Dudu says, see, everyone are dry. We all are done with the task. So, we all are the winners. Mouse says, then where is the prize? At that time, Alice takes few things from her pocket that she gets candies so that she distributes those candies to everyone as the prize. At that time, Dudu asks, Where's the prize for you? Don't you have anything else in your pocket? Alice keeps checking but she doesn't get anything. No, I didn't get anything. At that time, Alice finds a timber. Alice finds a timber. She takes the timber and gives to Dudu. So that Dudu gives the timber to Alice. And then now everyone got the prize and everyone are happy. Thank you.